Right, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Starting off though, Mercy. With the, I guess, debuters. No, they're, no, they're not debuters anymore. And again. Why is that only three? Why is that three? Fuck's sake. Oh, I love we'll it. We'll just have to give him a match next week so you can actually see who he is. <laughs> Right, and you can't hear this, but they both have fucking Finn Balor's theme song, for fuck's sake. <laughs> right, anyway. His opponent. <laughs> Sub-Zero, the inaugural No Mercy World Champion, and the inaugural No Mercy Impact Champion. Both reigns did not last long at all. Oh, and look at Brian Wade. Just... Okay, here we go, this match begins. Oh, oh my god! Marcus Reeves yes. <laughs> oh, Sub-Zero, what a lovely combination, not going to start any uh, wrestling lock-ups, just going to go full out carnage, oh, see what I did there. Sub-Zero now, dual breaker. Into a roll-up, oh, shoulders are down, lovely kick out. Sub-Zero of a stomp, it does not connect, however he slams Reeves' head back and now off the rope, Sub-Zero oh. hits his knee on the mat. Marcus Reeves now with a lock-up, Sub-Zero keeping his guard, runs at him, lovely oh. arm drag. Beautiful. And now, oh, oh my oh. god, what was that? From Sub-Zero, and now a neck breaker. Oh, Straight into the cover, Sub Zero to get a win against this kind of newbie kick out. I mean, they didn't, uh, the Carnage didn't have the most successful debut. They lost their debut. Northern Light Suplex into the cover, another kick out by Marcus Woods. I mean, they didn't get pinned, but they didn't win the match. Sub Zero, oh my uh, oh god! My Jesus. Sub Zero is on another level right now, but Marcus Reigns from the Oh mind. god. Don't take your eyes off the prize. Oh, God, another one of them inverted suplexes. Sub-Zero now, big reversal. Okay. Looking to lock up or something, keeping his distance. Oh. Right Sub-Zero now slams his oh, head Jesus. back. Marcus Reeves is in trouble. I don't know what Brian Wade is doing. He's been staying in that position the entire match. Oh. Got caught off the crossbody. No, 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 oh my oh. god, to ringside, and now Marcus Reeves, tricking Sub-Zero, I think Sub-Zero thought he was going to jump, and there we go, Brian finally coming his way, his way round to the right side of the ring, oh, Sub-Zero looks for a grapple there, Marcus Reeves with the receipt, And now they're both just staring each other down. Big insecurity. Oh, God. Don't know what the hell that was. Just kind of looked at each other. Wonder. I wonder what happened. Right, anyway. Big I think, I think DDT coming. Like, no. Big strikes. Boom. I think one of them said, Oh things. shit, I'm delayed. <laughs> I'm drag. And now Sub Zero saying, Is this all you got? Oh no, Sub Zero is in trouble. And now, oh, no! Oh! oh my god! The fucking the never ending frostbite, Sub Zero's finishing maneuver! And now, oh, Crossroads! Oh, Jesus! Sub Zero's finishing maneuver used against him, I don't think he saw that one coming. But he's hurt! I don't know what. What is Marcus Reeves thinking of here? Woolies in the mine. Marcus Reeves now. What is Don't he doing? Go, yeah. Twisting the legs. Oh what is this? Oh, oh big stomp God. to the back of the head to Sub Zero. Hooks the leg. Looking to maybe knock Sub Zero out. A kick out oh. it too. Keeping this match alive. And Marcus Reeves now with a possession. As this young man goes to the middle rope. Axe handle! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Jesus! 
And a drop kick collision in midair. And now Marcus Reeves, Doc on the crossroads, crossroads. number two of the match. One, two, and a kick out. I think that is actually a rolling fucking inverted Dini T, but I'm going to keep calling it the crossroads because fuck you. Suplex now onto Sub Zero, straight into the snappy cover. Sub Zero learning that Marcus Reeves is trying to uh, just take the energy out of him. Now going to lock him up again, no. Sub Zero with a reversal, duck under, no drop kick, kick to the midsection. Ryan Wade just watching intently at ringside. Not really done anything this match, which is which is good. Sub Zero, what is he doing? Lock up now. Now, what is going on with Marcus Reeves? Oh, ankle lock, too oh. close to the rope zone, I think. Sub Zero, Sub Zero, kick to the oh. ear. What the fuck? Big strike. An ankle lock, but it was far too close to the ropes. And Sub Zero manages to escape from it. And now Marcus Reeves oh, is going to stitch it back in. After Sub Zero escapes, and Sub Zero is oh, no, before tapping. his ankle gets snapped. Oh my god. He had that locked in. He definitely did. What the hell? And Carnage take their first win in the form of Marcus Reeves. And it was it was quite a good one. It was a decent match. Look at this, as soon as there was extra pressure applied, Sub Zero had no choice but to Here's tap out. What a win for this young man. Hope to see more of Carnage, not you know, bottling their debut. Second match of the night. The number one contenders match for the Impact Championship. Of course, Jeremiah is our Impact Champion. All the matches for Gold Rush. If you do not know, EW Gold Rush is the show where every single championship is put on the line. And that includes No Mercy participants. So as of right now, we have whoever wins this match going against Jeremiah. We have Kenny Gomez versus Nelson Goldman. We have Webb and Alex, a.k.a. The Bells, versus Wyatt and Smoke, a.k.a. The Storm Squad. We have Jackson Hart, the Super Kick King, going against the Prince of Extreme, Aaron Bell, for the European Championship. And then we also have Jay Pierce, the Paragon Jay Pierce versus Corrupted Knight for the World Championship. So quite a stacked card, if I do say say so myself. And now look at these chops by Ace. Isaiah Justice getting in there. Ace has had a, Ace had a really good match at the pay per view. To be honest, I think he has deserved an opportunity, a number one contenders opportunity. And now Ace. Drops him with a face breaker. And a Hurricane Runner by Stephen Webb, oh, part of two, call cool, into a stomp. Ace has had um, double the experience of both men in the ring right now. And now a big soul kick. And a Larian oh. by Stephen Webb, part of two, call. Cool. So hopefully we'll see him more tag team action soon. Of course, Matthew Harbour is the hardcore champion for EWE though, so I don't know when that's coming. Oh! Tries the baseball slide the the uh, chair. Oh, the chair goes out of the ring. They say no weapons in my ring, bitch. And they'll bring him down, Stephen Webb. Ace using his veteran instincts to um, conquer the ring at the moment. But now he's been called out by Isaiah Justice, who now goes to the cover after an uppercut and kick out of nothing by Ace. Stephen Webb just watching this match now. As these two wrestle it out in the ring, kind of the same strategy Jay Pierce did. And oh my god, Isaiah's going for a cover again. And now elbows by Ace. 
Ace now setting up for something there. No soul kick now. Once again, Stephen Webb is just watching this match unfold throughout his eyes right now. Sunset flip, power bomb into the cover by Ace to qualify for the Impact Championship match. Kick out at two. Now Stephen Webb gets back into the ring. And now he's going to, with his fresh, new uh, energy, he's going to use that to kick Ace, which sends him out of the ring and a nice knee to the head of Isaiah Justice. Oh, what is he doing there? Big boot right to the mark of fucking Isaiah Justice. And now wait a minute, Ace sneaks up from behind and Stephen Webb gets the shoulders oh, down. No, kick out. And now Isaiah Justice is in a super kick. What is he doing? Oh, big splash. Stephen Webb couldn't stop it. But he's looking to capitalize on Phil with a Larian. Isaiah almost landed onto Ace there for the cover. Now Stephen Webb getting Ace up. And now a soul kick. Oh. Ace now looking for a kick. No. Oh, no. I say Justice That's now re-entering the ring. Backstabber to the son of Austin. And now into the cover again. I say Justice, what the shit? How many covers are you going to go for? The one count finally on Ace. Now Ace rolls out of the ring. Stephen Webb now with a kick. big high kick. Isaiah Justice with a big strike, wait a minute, somersault on Prettier into the cover, but Ace is there with the break up. And they'll throw in Isaiah out the ring, wait a minute, Ace looking to capitalise on Stephen Webb, but Stephen Webb is back up to his feet. Oh, oh. Jesus Christ! Ace not taken lightly to steal oh, oh, Stephen oh. Webb with the receipt. And now it goes Isaiah Justice. Spanish fly there. Ace to the top turnbuckle where he loves to fly. And oh no! Oh, the <laughs> I don't think he meant to do that. I think he overshot it. Isaiah Justice really wanted to bring this chair into the match. Ace really not wanting it in. Stephen Webb missing all of his moves. And now a oh, face breaker. And now Ace into the cover, I say Justice is there though, and the referee is still down, holy fuck. Did Ace hurt him that bad? <laughs> uh, maybe. I don't know. And now Ace has set his toll to the top turnbuckle. Shooting star press! And into a number one. Horrible. And look at Ace. Stephen Webb going to give him time to celebrate after that because I think even he was impressed. And now Ace bringing Isaiah Justice back into the ring for both him and Stephen Webb to capitalise off of. But no, Isaiah now. What the hell is Stephen Webb doing? Doing a little ballerina dance. Now Ace is the man to exit the ring again. I think he's just asking the referee if he's okay at this point. Yeah. Oh no, Isaiah Justice with an arm drag. Oh my god, an instant strike to Ace as soon as he's back in the ring. That I can feel that from here. Ace sneaking up behind Stephen Webb, but Stephen Webb hears him coming. Two strikes, Stephen Webb. No jawbreaker. Oh. No, double on the hook. Fairy tale ending! 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 Fairy Looking to end this match. And Double this. underhook. Fairy tale ending. Ace for no. Oh my I saw god. Your oh, I saw your justice. Oh my god. Ace wanted to try and qualify. 
and get a shot to win his first title win probably ever actually think about it but he has been so close and Stephen Webb saying don't you dare try that again oh, oh my, my god. god oh Jesus and that is from all them stomps falling out of the ring a smart veteran move again Ace has had double the experience of everyone in this match. Isaiah Justice into the cover. One, two. Look out where Stephen Webb. Ace now into the ring. Sneaking around. Kick to the inner knee. Oh. And now roll Stephen Webb on. Shoulders are down. Shoulders are down. Kick out. But Steve Webb, he claims caught with a kick! Four and two end number three! Come on, as I've got this One, down. two, three, ace! Three, versus ace. Versus Jeremiah at Gold Rush. What a performance. Just what a performance. The, uh... Ace, the son of Austin. Look at him. Ace has been on a whole nother level this season. Could we and see this season him become champion? Impact Austin. champion. Jeremiah is, is on. Jeremiah. Yeah, that is his biggest obstacle, quite literally and physically. Right. Now on to the main event. This show has been pretty um pretty straightforward. No trash talking from anyone backstage. It's been kind of nice, I guess. It's been willing to ask, right? What the fuck is with the cars on the stage? I think they're PJ Styles' cars. He owns two off. identical cars. Yeah, one breaks, you have to have a spare one. <laughs> yeah, but in this case, he's shoving them off in bloody No Mercy Wrestling. <laughs> right, anyway, this match begins with a number one oh, contender oh, to the World Championship, and he's raining fists down on Valentine. Have these two faced before? Probably. If I had to guess who won, it was probably Kenny, Kenny Gomez. Yeah. He'll be going off to face Nelson Goldman after winning a number one contenders match last pay-per-view against Ace. Oh, oh my god. god. And Valentine is in deep trouble. Second oh journey. my god. Jesus Christ. Oh, not a third. A I third one. one. Literally Val to Suplex City. Valentine has just practically travelled the ring with that. Oh no, oh no. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! Oh no. Kenny sorting out a new tactic. Can he do that to Nelson Goldman though? I, I, I highly doubt it. Jesus Christ. Kenny now, oh, what has he got in planned wrestling oh takedown? God. Valentine is just getting his ass beat. Of course, it is just the beginning of the match, but oh my god! Kenny is angry. Gorilla. Oh my god! Press drops him. Valentine gets up, but for what? She into the oh ring. Oh into the ring. <laughs> Referee's gonna go down though. Maybe we should hire him. <laughs> <laughs> to be a wrestler. Versus Kenny Gomez. Can he put away Kenny? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> There's the big punch! And that might be it for Valentine. No, Valentine manages to get out of what Kenny was planning. Get, managed to get away from the Kenny possession. And now Valentine out of the ring with an angry Kenny Gomez chasing him. That's not something you want to hear. Now back into the ring. Oh god, Kenny, what is he doing? Oh my god. Just ripping part the announcement tables. 
and just throwing all the monitors off for no reason off the roads. Oh, oh God! Jesus Christ, man! Kenny now into a armbar for Joe. An armbar. Will Valentine tap here? No, he won't. No. But now, what is he doing? Into another for Joe. Armbar. Is Valentine going to tap here? Is Valentine going to tap out? No, he's not. No. What is he doing? <laughs> oh. What the fuck? Oh no, Valentine now looking for a power. Yeah, you're not going to let Kenny go, but that easily lets him lift it. Sunset flip, power bomb one, two, no. I think Valentine kind of let that one go. Oh, oh no. God, Kenny is just pulling out all the stops on Valentine right now. He is angry, he is pissed. Valentine's off. not an easy beat. Oh, but this is Kenny Gomez. He's only been defeated by what? Nelson Goldman? Oh god. Oh god. Draw. Nope. Oh, Valentine got out of it! I think only Ace has done that, right? Oh my god! That's what you get for getting out of it, I guess. Whatever that move is. Don't escape the clutches. Kenny Gomez. Oh, God. And oh. center of the ring. That's it for Valentine. One, two, and Lord Valentine kicks out. Oh, no. Kenny's oh. not happy. Kenny is not happy. Elbow. I couldn't tell if that was low or not. Now, Val. Valentine. Looking to oh. slow down this possession a little bit. Surely Valentine gets something if he beats the number one contender, right? Oh, neckbreaker. Uh, if, if he can sniff yeah, out so, the win, probably. maybe he gets a number one contender shot after, obviously, Kenny and Nelson's a thing. I mean, I would oh give him a... Oh, my God! Oh, oh God, Look no! Look at the break the arms off of Valentine! Oh, no! Oh, my God! Oh, he's tapping! The, the, the referee no, called it off! The referee called it off! Because he was afraid of Valentine's arms getting ripped off his body. The Valentine now walking away. Uh, oh no. no. Oh no. no. Jesus oh, Christ. Come on. You don't walk away unscathed from Kenny Gomez. Oh my. What the hell. No, 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 Valentine, look no. out! Oh, Jesus! Straight into the still step. Arm first! And this has been No Mercy! Come on! Oh. You've done so fucking well. Yeah. Twat.